Hello and welcome to the HGC or Hardcore Gamers Club, your safe spot for all things gaming. Uh, here mostly I talk about electronics as opposed to actual gaming. Although I'll be putting some of that up myself sometime, sometime in the future. Uh, this particular video is talking about your PCs. All right. Now, you've heard me talk about the game systems and the dust and the clean outs and stuff. And you need to know that your PC also needs to be cleaned out. But you know what? I want to show you something here. Watch. I want, I want you to take a look. Okay. You see this? This is a warranty seal. Let me correct the focus on this a little bit. My mouse. Sorry about that. Okay. Where's my mouse? There we go. One second. Okay. Now we got the autofocus. It'll probably go in and out a little bit. Alright. This is your PC. The majority of your PCs are going to have thumb screws that will allow you to get inside your system. Okay? Simple enough. Two screws, the whole side comes out. See that dust up inside there? See that dust up inside there? You see that little warranty seal that they put on this system? Alright, this warranty seal when put on by a repairman is for nothing more than to speed up the failure of your hard drives, your motherboard, your fans, your power supply, and quite frankly just about everything in there. All right? This PC is designed so that you can get inside your PC. Why would you need to get inside your PC? Isn't it a little obvious? Let's turn this this way. Is it not a little obvious as to why you need to get inside your PC? Okay, look at that. All right. See that? All right. This dust building up inside your PC is the number one killer of all your caps, your hard drives your disk drives, your power supplies, your chips, your graphics processors. It dries out the thermal paste by causing it to run extremely hot. The hotter it runs, the hotter this board gets, the more likely these caps are going to blow. Okay, okay here. Okay. A lot of airflow restriction. Right, so you wonder why they put that warranty seal on there to keep you out. Well, first of all, you're supposed to have access to this so that you can upgrade drives and stuff like that. So why would he need to put a warranty seal on your system when you're supposed to have access to it? Okay, what if you wanted to upgrade the RAM? Okay, what if you wanted to put in a new video card? You break the warranty seal, now you have to pay all over again for anything that he may have warrantied. Okay, there are ways to. <coughs> there are ways that they can put these things in these components or repairs inside your systems 
and not use a warranty seal. There is no need, let me get rid of the autofocus here, there is no need, well could, there we go, okay, there's no need to be putting a warranty seal on anything. Microsoft and Sony does it for their game systems because they want it to fail within three to four, maybe five years. Really depends on your air quality. So that every time they come out with a new generation system, by that time the majority of them have failed and they've raped you for the repair costs of a hundred and something odd dollars that you know if you break the warranty seal they won't even allow you to pay to have it repaired. Uh, take these things to places like Geek Squad or whatever, they're going to put a warranty seal on it because they know that is going to happen to your computer. All right. It is nothing more than a scam against you. Okay, Nothing more than a scam against you. If you put a warranty seal on an air-cooled system you will reduce its lifespan by as much as 75% or more depending on your air quality and depending on how much you use your system. Okay. Uh, so, you know, if you're taking it to, if you're taking a PC to a place for repair, ask them if they're going to put a warranty seal on the box and deny you access to get in for cleaning. If they say yes, they're going to put a warranty seal on it, take it somewhere else. I'm not saying take it to me, I'm just saying take it somewhere else. There's absolutely no reason to put a warranty seal on a computer, especially a computer, that draws air in to keep it cool. There's no way to clean it once you put that warranty seal on it without voiding their warranty. So. They want you to void that warranty because they, you know, if you want to upgrade or replace a drive, they want you to bring it back to them. Okay, it's just a way for them to make money. Chips burn out faster, your caps blow up faster, thermal paste dries out faster, leading to cracked solder joints, <coughs> overheating issue, freezing issues, overall slowdowns of your computer. Okay. You should be taking these PCs and opening them up, preferably once every 30 days or so, but you can get by longer if you open it up 30 days later and it looks spotless. By all means, go ahead and clean it and then maybe wait two months. But you have to clean these systems. If you don't, you're going to wind up with blown caps. You're going to wind up with hard drives failing. The heat of this system is the number one cause of hard drive failures. These hard drives run hot. They need to be cooled. If there's no cooling in your system, your hard drive will fail. And then all of your precious pictures are gone. Okay, so please, if you're taking an electronic to anyone, if they're going to put a warranty seal, especially a computer, if they're going to put a warranty seal on it and deny you access to proper cleaning and maintenance, they, in my opinion, are nothing more than a criminal because they're intentionally reducing the lifespan of the parts, and I'm talking every part in there, by as much as 75% or more depending on your air quality. Okay. So this one right here is salvage job. Uh, <coughs> excuse me. Uh, I'm just doing data recovery. I don't know if he wants to try and salvage this system. It's fairly old, but uh, it died long before its time. Trust me, long, long before its time. Stay safe, happy gaming, everybody, and don't forget. Clean out your systems, that dust will kill it.